how to set up apt cache server using apt cacher ng in ubuntu first let me install apt cacher ng after that you can change the apt cacher in the configuration you can change the cache directory you can change the log directory let me open this configuration file so this is a default location of the apt cache or ng if you want to change you can change it here then the log directory then the port number there is total of other configurations are there so right now i am not going to cover that let me close this file It's a, you, you can check the you can access you can uh, access the web interface of apt cache or ng like this go to the browser and specify the ip of the machine where you installed this apt cache or ng then this port number 3142 you will get the a web interface like this so here it's explained how to configure the client you can read this so in order to configure the client what you have to do is go to your client machine and create a file like this sudo vim etc apt apt con so i am going to do the client configuration in the same machine so i created a file then there you can put this line So here this IP is the IP of the machine where where we installed this apt cache or ng then the port so let's save this file then let me install some package using a apt package manager before that let me check the cache directory there is nothing then let me install this JIT using this apt package manager so this command will download so there is some issue see I think this IP is wrong actually it's 104 so 104 is the IP of this machine yeah. so I configured client and server in the same machine so let me check this time there is something in the cache and let me install this package
okay it installed let me check the cache so in the cache you can see one folder it's created then the pool then the main folder inside main folder you can see the folder name g then jit inside that you can see the debian package of the jit okay that that means it's cached the debian packages so let me let me remove the jit so i am uninstalling the jit and let me delete the local cache of the upgrade package manager rmsrf jit stop so i removed the jit package from the local cache so this jit package still there in the apt cache rng cache directory so i am going to install jit again this time it will take the jit package from the cache see it's downloaded from the cache only it, it didn't take much time so this way you can cache your debian packages and you can install from there so if you want to restart the apt cache rng you can use this command.